Yeah. Well, as for me and Fallout, I have never and probably will never touch a Fallout game. You're not no. missing any of them. Yeah, well, you know, no nothing against them. It's just not the genre that I would ever really play. Or, I guess the setting more than the genre, because the, the genre setting, is yeah. RPG. It means... It's an RPGs in quotes, really, because there's a whole video I could link you about how Fallout 3 and 4, and especially 3, but probably also 4, are not really RPGs. They're really not. I mean, like, if you want to play those kinds of games in that setting, you know, like, post-apocalyptic, etc. Honestly, you're just better off playing... They're not entirely similar games, but you're honestly just better off playing Borderlands. Yeah, that's pretty close. Even though I played maybe Borderlands 1 for like two hours, and then that was that. I played 1 and 2, and then my brother wanted me to play with him the, the pre-sequel. So he bought it for me, oh. and then it didn't work on LAN. Good. It kept disconnecting, so Great. then we just stopped. So there's that. Remember that time... No. You know, that one time. Why does yeah, Growlithe so learn helping hand? Growlithe, you don't have hands. Do you? Is there something I should know? He has... Nope, let's... We're not gonna think about it. Alright, Cubone. Anyway. I don't actually want to fight all the trainers, I'm just going for items. But as a consequence, I'm accidentally running into a few trainers. Colonel. The card key. Needs to be warmed up. Ah! Yeah, it needs to be warmed up and cooled down in order to fit into different locks, but I only have fire. I'll get the ability to cool it down after I, uh... Snake. Sleep. Just put the card key into a fridge. A, fr a fridge? <laughs> this is when you go on to explain that the fridge can cool things down? Because Snake doesn't know what things are. Come on. I, I know. <laughs> ah, poison gas, no. If only the, uh, person that heals me wasn't, like, 30 feet to my left. That's fine. Well, it is fine, because the person that can heal me is 30 feet to my left. Are you sure it's not to your right? It's to... Um... It's to... It's to... It's to Red's right. But it's to my left. Alright. So this is the last floor with items. I don't think the 11th floor has anything other than the Master Ball and the Lapras. And the boss fight. Welcome to the 10th floor. So good of you to join me. No! I will burn your Machoke. Also, it's level 33. Like, the level's actually kind of ramped up a bit there. Difficulty curve? What's this? Oh, no. Don't throw your dog. Oh. Now Machoke has identified the dog as a dog and then gets flame wheeled. I have identified that this dog is a dog. Fork. Alternatively. Oh, yeah. Man, we're not dating this at all by just... 
We are having Luigi's Mansion I mean, memes. I explained everything. Yeah. So, I only have one thing to really follow that up with. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, time to do the rival fight, actually, because I forgot about that. What's he gonna send out first? It's gonna be the... It's gonna be the... Ooh. The Volt oh, It's usually the Pidgeot, so... Because he's a Pidgey idiot. Um... Yeah. He doesn't see me around this table. I understand vision cones. Pidgeot. Have a Hitmonlee. Ha ha ha! Lunch. Get wrecked! Oh, execute. Um, whatever shall I do? Wow, his Pokemon are higher level than mine. Um. Hmm. Alright, Dodrio, just be faster than an Alakazam. Go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Even. Gyarados, huh? You know what? Let's use the Venomoth. Why not? Let's just systematically ruin your day. By... Sun's boring you. Supersonic. Alright, that's a mild problem that I didn't think about. Anyway, take a drink. In Gen 4 and 3, it's only 60 power. So good. Alright, Venomoth, now if you could not die, that'd be great. There we go. Oh, Venomoth is dead. Venomoth is not dead. Venomoth is dead. Venomoth is of the dead. Shit. Yeah, I didn't really have a good... I don't really have a good Pokemon to take out Gyarados yet. That's just... That's just the reality of, this, of the matter. Like... Oh, now you hurt yourself in confusion. Just take Nidoking's satisfaction of being able to thrash you. Anyway, we're gonna drop some rocks on a lizard. It'll be great. Bye. He's gonna... He's gonna do some stuff. And then I'm gonna go heal. Smell you later. Because Venomoth will actually be useful against the Nidoking. Or Nidoqueen? I don't remember which one. I think he only has the Nidoking right now. Nidorino, but Nidoking. He doesn't get the Nidoking to the gym fight. And then also, Venomoth has Giga Drain to take out the Rhyhorn. I don't know how to take out the King of Scott. Well, I do. It's called Hit on my. But we'll see what he sends out first. Actually, he's not going to send out anything just yet. There's going to be one more rocket fight. So what does Q-Bone actually stand for? Because it isn't Cube and Bone. The cute bone I don't know. I, I mean, yeah, probably. I just, I wanted the, I wanted the mental image of a cube bone. There it is. All right, stop picturing it. 
No. It's too late for you. You pictured it. It's too late. You're already dead. Oh, he sent out a Marowak. Oh. Well, then you sent out a Marowak. I mean, we could have had a Marowak. We could have also not had a Marowak. Yeah, this isn't Gen 1, where the special stat is okay enough that you can just teach Marowak Ice Beam and then it's fine. Alright. <sighs> oh, there is. There's the game. Yeah. There's one item that I missed. Oh no. Yeah, uh, well, I guess you gotta restart. <laughs> just restart the game from the beginning. We missed an item. Need a ring now. That's me to go ring now. You say hi to Vendemoth. Oh, this rock type will beat the bug. Okay, then we swap out for the Kangaskhan. Because, no, Vendemoth will not be able to take on that Kangaskhan, I don't think. But this'll hurt. Oh no, Himonli's defense went down. Whatever shall I- <laughs> Doing it. Oh. oh, this is why this- These lines are garbage until Gen 4. That's the strongest move it's got, I guess. And you thought Nita Queen was threatening. Alright, give me a Master Ball. I can't buy it anywhere. Alright. Man, look at this. Look at this Master Ball. Right? Isn't it just like. The best. Like, oh, my hand slipped off! Oh, no. Who cares? Alright, this is the part where we can actually soft reset for a decent nature on this Lapras, so I'm gonna do it. I don't think that's a good nature. Well, do I care? I know my other Pokemon have good natures. Especially not- I could have soft reset for a decent nature on the Hitmonlee. Eh, screw it. Anyway, look, we have a full team now. But is it good? It's okay. You, um... <laughs> you definitely picked a couple Pokemon that I would never use before, so that's good. I mean, my choices were taken. For later. Oh, they're being saved for later? Apparently. Yeah, the whole one use rule kind of makes things interesting for team building. Because we actually have to make. Um... Or we could just have to do every game. Huh. Yeah. We have, to, we have to talk about that. Do we want to use Riolu in Platinum, or do we want to wait until Black 2? Because we're going to use it. Good question. But do we want to wait until after the sixth badge to start to actually just hatch a Riolu? Or do we want to just catch a Riolu super early on in Gen, in gen 5? I guess Gen 5. Yeah. It's okay. We'll, we'll get to the team building when we, when we get to the team building for those ones. Yeah, that's in like another year. <laughs> Probably. Because <laughs> we got to go through uh, Soul Silver and then... Omega Ruby or Alpha Sapphire first. Anyway. Uh, I think Dodrio is just going to take on the entirety of Sabrina's gym. Are you ready for this? Watch, watch, as, Do watch, as, Do watch as Dodrio blasts through all of these trainers. And just, like... Oh, man. He's just destroying them. Isn't that crazy? 
how like oh wait 